All right, you guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna be covering the brand new DLC 15 characters. As you can see, we have all three on screen. This is gonna be my very first time playing as them. I am stoked for this. Make sure to drop a like on today's video. I'll greatly appreciate it. And before we hop into the actual showcase, I just wanna say a big thanks to Ellie for sending me all this and to Slow Plays for getting all this to actually work for me. I appreciate both of them. Without further ado, let's hop straight into it. Starting things off with Gamma 1. There he is. No way. Look at his idol stance. Yo, I am hyped. He looks extremely cool. Oh, what the heck just happened? What the heck just happened? Technical difficulties. Oh, we can't zoom in on the character for some reason. That's strange. All right, let's go ahead and check out Gamma 2 for the one time. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, just as pose. Hero pose. Nice. All right, let's go ahead and check out DBS Superhero Gohan. There oh, he has the same uh, idol stance as original Gohan. Interesting. His hair model is absolutely insane. Of course, we have the new boots, uh, new gi, I think. The wristbands are a bit different. And the glasses. Of course, he has his unique transformation where he removes his glasses, then transforms. Can't wait to see that. Let's go ahead and cover the skill sets real quick. We have Hawk Charge, which I believe is a different version from the original Hawk Charge. Masenko, Burst Rush, Maximum Charge, Super Dragon Flight, Super Kamehameha, Spirit Slash, and Potential Unleashed. As for Gamma 1, we have Heroic Assault, Shooting Strike, Android Rush, Maximum Charge, Burning Strike, Super Gamma Blast, and instant rise and of course the new super soul i'll be the one to fight you oh uh, wait let's see his super soul uh i'm not as rusty as i look i think that's a new one as well for gamma 2 we have heroic counter gamma blast gamma impact maximum charge victory rush core breaker instant rise and for the super soul you need to be more careful yo i think my favorite character is gamma 2 just because of his character man I mean, just look at him. He's filled with personality. He was my favorite in the movie. And yeah, <laughs> I think these two characters, Gamma 1 and 2, are going to be the stars of this DLC pack. So without further ado, let's hop straight into the showcase. I just got some new intel on who the villains are. You still haven't figured out you're going to lose? I'll accept this mission. Leave it to me. Gamma 1, reporting for duty. It's up to me to keep everyone safe. I'm fighting for real. Hope you're ready for me. Your evil alliance will be no more after I'm finished. The only evildoer here is you. Unique character dialogue. That is intense. Yo, we need to discover all of them. <laughs> all right, so we're going to start things off with Gohan DBS Superhero. And it actually won't let me lock off from the character. I think this is part of his Super Soul because it is active at the top left corner. All right, real quick, let's go over the model. Uh, yeah, the new hairstyle is absolutely insane. I would love to see this uh, for CACs in the next DLC pack, just because I know a lot of you guys like Gohan's new hairstyle as well. He looks extremely cool, man. <laughs> oh, with the glasses, I can't wait to see the transformation. All right, so let's just go ahead and start things off with the moveset. We have the square combo string. Oh, all right. So it does seem a bit similar to original Gohan. I mean, we all knew we were going to see some similarities, but it is also a bit different. The startup of his combo string and the combo ender right here. We do the Gohan kick. Pretty dang nice. As for the triangle combo screen. Oh, look at that. Yo, he did a backflip. Yo, that was cool. So he starts off the triangles combo string with a backflip kick attack no way the sauce the style points <laughs> all right i think this is my favorite string so far as for triangle into square oh oh that messed me up <laughs> here it is oh yeah this is the burst rush yeah this is in the dlc 15 trailer very nice yeah so once again some similarities but he's not a complete reskin which i really do like i think this is my new Gohan main. Um, let's go ahead and grab. Uh, we have the original Dragon Throw. Perfect. Uh, let's go ahead and use the first square input into Triangle. 
He just does a simple knockback. The first four inputs of square into triangle should be the same. Oh, there it is. First five. Oh, I dropped it. No. All right, so after he does the backhand right there. Oh, let's go. Woo! All right, once again, some similarities right there with the uh, downward attack. First six inputs of lights into triangle. Ah, oh, same thing. Perfect. <laughs> Let's try to do some uh, different combo strings. Let's just mix a bunch of them together. Hey. <laughs> awesome. Um, what else do we have? I think that's it for his entire combo string. Yeah, so far, I really do like the character. Let's go ahead and cover the skill palette. Start things off with Hawk Charge. Oh! All right, so that's the exact same as Videl's move. But based off the trailer, I think we can do some different combo strings. Keep it! Oh, 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 there it is! There it is! So I'm actually holding on to the skill inputs. So if you hold on to it, you'll do a five hit combo, which is extremely cool. It does take two key bars. And the original one, of course, only takes one key bar. Yo, look at that cool idle stance that we get after we land the ultimate. Or the super move. Right there. He literally poses for a couple frames. And then he goes back to his normal idle stance. That's interesting. We have Masenko. Wait, can we charge it? Uh, No, we can't. Uh, let's see if we can still do the backflip version of it. We can. Awesome. Burst Rush. Now, this is going to be a bit different from the original move as well. Let me set him to super strong. So when I do a counter, I should snap vanish back and then forward. Let's go ahead and try it. Oh, that is awesome. Look how awesome that is. No way. <laughs> ah, yo, Gamma 1's moveset. It's so clean. I'm being spoiled right now. <laughs> oh, that super move. Android Strike, I believe. Not too sure. Oh, but that counter is absolutely insane. I love how he's extremely similar to the original Gohan, but just with some extra style points, if you will. I mean, the burst rush, the moveset. Uh, unfortunately, we can't counter key blast attacks. I mean, that's normal. Oh my gosh, he's utilizing every single super and ultimate attack in his arsenal. Please, Gamma One. <laughs> All right, once more. <laughs> That snap vanish is literally my favorite part. All right, let's go ahead and use maximum charge. We also get the yellow aura when we land burst rush. Uh, we have the original blue aura when we charge. As for the ultimates, super dragon flight. All right, let's go ahead and save that for last. Let's use the evasive spirit slash. Oh, yo, yo. <laughs> They changed it as well. Hey, as I just said, similarities, but also differences. Wait, so how much stamina bars does that take? If you hold on to it, it takes three stamina bars. If you just use it without holding on to it, it still takes three stamina bars. All right. So you can kind of break your opponent's ankles by juking them out, you know, snap behind them. Oh, look at that. That's awesome. Unfortunately, at least I don't think we can get these moves for our CACs, but it's totally fine. It just makes this character even more unique. Um, let's go ahead and use Super Kamehameha. I know that this has a second variation to it, so let me hold on to it. I believe it's it works as a counter as well, so you have to have the enemy hit you. Yup, there it is! Yo, that's extremely fast! Way faster than Warp Kamehameha. Look at that! <laughs> as soon as he hits you, you just snap. Oh! Oh! So obviously, he has to hit you while you're charging the Kamehameha Blast. Otherwise, you'll just get your stamina broken. <laughs> Alright, let me just quickly recover. No! Please, stop! Ah! Mm. Strike now! <laughs> Oh, it also dodges Key Blast attacks! We have to test this out with one of his ultimates. 
we have to okay i'm not sure if this is his key blast ultimate but we'll just go ahead and try it out it is oh no way no way yeah this is far superior to warp kamehameha at least i think unfortunately it doesn't break through super armor so if you dodge an ultimate it'll do zero damage <laughs> so it works best for super attacks and normal melee attacks right let's actually test it with his second ultimate there it is extremely clean yeah i love how every single super attack and ultimate has a different variation to it except for masenko that's literally the same scale as normal masenko uh, let's go ahead and use Super Dragon Flight for the moment of truth. Make sure to drop a like on today's video. Let's check out his new ultimate. Take this. <laughs> the ultimate sure you can. Yeah, so he does two Super Dragon Flights. He does, well, I guess you can call the first one the normal Dragon Flights or just Dragon Flights. And the second version of it, Super Dragon Flight right here. Yeah, he launches straight up into the sky. Let me hold on to it. To see if there's something different to it. Yeah, no, it does mad damage. And it's a three bar ultimate. So that's not bad right there. As for the transformation. Oh, this is going to be absolutely insane. Oh, the animation. <laughs> All right. All right. That was extremely fast as well. Once again, I can't lock off from the character because the Super Soul is active. Oh no, this is the best I can do right now. Look at his new hair model. So we do have the original Potential Unleashed glow around the character. Uh, his glasses, he removes them. Uh, the new Potential Unleashed hair. We need this as well for CACs. I love how fast the transformation is. And look at that. When we revert back to our base form, we get the glasses. <laughs> Pretty interesting. Uh, but let's break this down for the one time. So he reaches for his glasses, removes them, throws them onto the ground. Wait, do they disappear? Oh, they do. So they just shrink. Look at that. <laughs> oh, no way. Yeah, it just shrinks and erases itself from existence. Then he charges. I love this pose directly from the movie as well. We have the electricity effect right there. Let's go ahead and use the moveset. It should be the same. Yeah. Obviously, his moveset isn't going to change after transforming. Uh, but let's go ahead and use the triangle one. Yeah, this triangle combo string is my favorite one just because of the backflip he does at the start of it. Triangle into square for the one time. Oh, oh, oh. Burst rush. Ah. Oh, wait, let's actually charge the triangle inputs. Oh, look at that. Hey. Isn't this the animation he does when he fights against Gamma 1? I believe it is. <laughs> look at that. He just teleports. <laughs> Boom. Oh, boy. Yo, we need the flurry kicks. Remember when he first transformed, he did like five kicks to Gamma's face. Oh, that was intense. Yeah, we need that. I guess we have it right there. Never mind. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and use the super attacks now. Hawk charge. The enhanced version, of course. Oh, Masenko. We're going to use all the different versions of the supers. Burst rush. Oh, let's see if we can counter. Oh, we can counter ultimate strike moves. <laughs> <laughs> this Gohan's overpowered. Super Dragon Flight. Teleport to me. I dare you. Take this. Oh no. <laughs> I missed completely. Impossible. Even more damage right there. And as for Super Kamehameha. <laughs> this is the complete Gohan DBS Superhero Showcase. Let's go ahead and move to the next two characters. Your evil alliance will be no more after I'm Whoa, finished. Whoa, he looks extremely cool. Yo, the models for Gamma 1 and 2 are actually top notch. Look at that. We have his idol stance right there. We have this aura emitting from his body. I think this is because of his super soul. But yeah, the model work, once again, absolutely insane. 
Uh, we have the cape physics. Oh, look at his run animation. No way. <laughs> Yo, can we speed up though? We need to speed up. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Let's go ahead and start things off with the key blast. Just because I want to see if he uses his uh, ray gun. He actually does. Let's go. <laughs> Let's charge it for the one time. Full power. Oh, all right. Something similar to the Frieza CACs, right? Where they shoot out a death beam. His Key Blast also has a very distinct sound effect. All right, let's go ahead and use the grab. No way. I knew it. I knew from the start of the Content City TV event trailers that Gamma 1 and 2 were going to be the best characters. The style points, look at that! The opponent twirls after he gets hit by the Ray Gun Blast. Let's go ahead and use this moveset, starting things off with the square combo string. Pretty dang cool. I believe he uses his Ray Gun in the middle of certain combos as well. So that was the uh, square one. Let's go ahead and use the triangle combo. Oh, oh, there it is. Oh my gosh. Very forceful. We do that chop at the end right there. Oh, oh, we dropped it. I like how he does three emphatic hits. How can we keep dropping the last attack? But for the three heavy hits, he one right there, two right there, and the third one with the karate chop. Next, we have the triangle onto square combo string. Oh, I think I did it right. Yeah, there it is. Oh, pretty nice. I do like the heavy attacks. He does another one right here. The knee. Oh, wait. Wait, let's see if we can actually uh, land that with a stamina break. Wait, first, let's see his actual stamina breaks. So we have an elbow drop right there. As for the heavy, another judo chop. So let's see if that combo string actually lands. Uh, what was it? Triangle square. Oh, I dropped it. I dropped it. All right, let me try one more time. <laughs> I want to try to figure out at least some. Stamina breaks. Oh, no. So it doesn't work. Interesting. Oh, let's actually check out Gohan's stamina breaks. I forgot to showcase those. Of course, they're the same. <laughs> Fair enough. Next, we have the square into the triangle combo string. Hey, we do that. He will drop. First four lights into heavy. First five lights into heavy. Oh, look at that. What the heck? He does a snap animation? That's extremely different. I don't remember him doing that in the movie. Comment down below if this is referencing something because I don't really remember at all. His dash animations are cool. Look at that. He kind of slides to the left and right. And he, he's dabbing. He's doing the hero justice pose. Um, next, we have the... Oh, he has very cool movements. What else do we have? I think that's it for the moveset, right? Yeah, that's everything. Let's go ahead and cover the skill attacks. Oh... Starting things off with a shooting strike. Oh, so this is the uh, kick attack that they do, right? Gamma 2 has a blue version of this. Uh, let's hold on to it. See if we can charge it. No, that's the same. So he shoots out the ray gun first. If that lands, it'll connect with the dive kick. As for heroic assault. Oh, dropped it. I think this is the counter attack, right? Wait. Oh, it's just a counter move. It doesn't do anything else. Oh, wait, there it is. We have to keep tapping it. Okay, so let me hold on to it first. Yeah, it doesn't do anything. Let me tap it. There it is. There it is. So it kind of stuns the opponent. Oh, and you can continue into any combo string that you like. Um, let me actually try to use the counter version of it. I think only for uh, melee attacks could be totally wrong. No, key blast attacks as well. Oh, th there it is. We finally got it. We finally got it. I think this also works with key blast attacks. Look at that. Okay, let me keep tapping it this time around. Oh, all right. So if you keep tapping it, 
uh, it, the counter won't work because you're gonna, of course, try to do the strike attack, which makes sense. Ah! All right, let me try that again. Take this. Oh! Oh! Can it dodge ultimate attacks? Let's try that out for the one time. This is gonna be very interesting. All right, do it now! <laughs> Wrong ultimate, but as you guys just saw, it works against Key Blast ultimate attacks. It doesn't do anything though, just because, yeah, the Ray Gun can't, you know, overpower an ultimate. But as for the Strike ultimate... Oh, I did it way too late. Way too late. Let's try it once more. Oh! Maybe it doesn't work against Strike ultimates? Maybe I just have to time it a bit better. There it is. There it is. Yeah, it doesn't do anything, though, because of super armor. As for Android Rush, this is the original move from Android 16, I believe. It, it might be a bit different, though. I'm not sure. Next, we have Maximum Charge. He has more of the clear potential unleashed aura. Uh, ultimate Attacks. This is going to be absolutely crazy. Uh, Burning Strike, the move from Future Trunks. Uh, do we have the second variation of it? We do. We snap behind the opponent. And for his signature move, Super Gamma Blast. Let's check this out. Yo, that actually lasted for a long minute. And that ultimate outro right there. Very cool animation. He throws his cape up into the wind and then it just flows. Nice. <laughs> it's so smooth. I believe we can hold on to it. Uh, we have three different stages, if I recall correctly. There's the second version of it. It's a bit larger. As for the third version, you just hold on to it all the way and we get a unique camera angle to it. Right there. Ooh, the close-ups. Yo, he's aiming down his sights. Gohan is done for. No! The key blast effect. The design. It looks extremely cool. Look at this. It's like many different energy rays. I mean, it makes sense because it is coming from a ray gun. But I really do like how they try to make unique key blast styles or textures to certain characters. We saw this with UI Sign Goku with Sign of Awakening, Kale and Khalifla. They both have their unique key blast textures and other characters as well. And this is it for Gamma 1. Now let's go ahead and showcase Gamma 2. That mark. The Red Ribbon Army? Bingo! And the plan now isn't to test you, but kill you. This intro is absolutely insane. Did you guys see that? <laughs> I knew it that Gamma 2 was going to be my favorite. I mean, his idol stance alone, his animations. As always, starting things off with the square combo string. And I think Gamma 2 is the one that implements his ray gun uh, into his combo strings, if I'm not mistaken. Or it might have been Gamma 1. But we just went over the showcase and we didn't see any of that, right? But as for his light combo string, yeah, look at that. We get a cool camera angle right there for the combo ender. He does a knockdown. Oh, doing mad damage. <laughs> Yo, Piccolo just broke that boulder. Uh, as for the heavy combo string. Oh, oh, hey. Oh my gosh, yeah. Already with two unique camera angles. Yo, his running animation. <laughs> oh, boom. So he does a dive kick right there. <laughs> Uh, let's go ahead and use the grab. A little extra. Justice always prevails. Yeah, what the heck? Same exact grab as Gamma 1, except we get a different camera angle and an animation. He throws his gun and we get a power increase. This always prevails. With an awesome voice line? Yeah, Gamma 2 is definitely the best. All right, so he uses his ray gun as well. Perfect. Let's go ahead and charge it all the way. Full power. Mm -hmm. First input of square into triangle. Oh, very forceful. 
first four should be the same as always there it is i dropped it never mind first five <laughs> we'll take it yo what is this is this like a defense increase so first a power increase for the grab and i think a defense or speed increase for the first five inputs of square into triangle combo string <laughs> Very unique to the character. Six inputs of square into triangle. Alright, yeah, that just mixes uh, two of the different combo strings. Uh, this is it for Gamma 2's moveset. Yo, based off the trailer though, didn't Gamma 1 use his ray gun? Like he kind of like shoots it backwards or something? Yeah, I did not see that at all. Maybe I missed a combo string or something. I don't know. Let me know down below in the comments. I'll greatly appreciate it. Uh, let's go ahead and check out his super attacks. Keyword counter. Oh, look at that. All right, let's see if the force shield or whatever it is can actually, you know, hit the opponent. All right, so it does absolutely nothing. Uh, so I think this just counters super or key blast attacks. So we have light grenade so let's go ahead and test this out for the one time oh <laughs> yo the speed i love how they're capturing the speed for both characters as for gamma blast oh all right oh you can charge it full power oh oh yo that's the ultimate attack from the movie when he uh he used it against cell max it didn't phase cell max at all and it's not as large but, once again, going back to the texture of the key blast attacks, extremely cool and different. We have the ripple effect, the contrail, and the orb itself with this cool, misty energy effect to it. It kind of has this icy look to it, right? We also have that distinct sound effect in there as well. As for Gamma Impact... Oh, nice, a strike move. Oh, oh, so this is the super attack with the Automata Pios, right? Hey, look at that. Why is Gamma 2 the best character? And the heroic pose right there. Ooh, the lighting around the character. Oh, look at that. That's a cool screenshot right there. Maximum charge, nothing too fancy there. Victory rush. And we have the evasive instant rise as well. Oh, core breaker. I'm extremely hyped for this. This is his self-sacrificing move. You know, Gamma 2 is a true warrior. And he's just an all-around great character, I think. Yo, here it is. Full power Gamma 2. <laughs> <laughs> no way yo i love how he flies up into the sky and then he charges right here into his full power state yo this sh should actually be like a transformation or something right or maybe like a power increased super attack because this is extremely cool and i just noticed his pupils disappear oh right here is the best shot ever no way <laughs> Yo, full power! Get him, Gamma 2! But yeah, his pupils disappear. Man's just going all out. Here it is! Here it goes! Of course, if you guys enjoyed today's showcase video, make sure to drop a like. I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you guys for watching as always, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. And also comment down below which character is your favorite. Peace. <laughs>